जीवन मिलिट्स के दाने दाने की जिन्हें भूल गए थे हम सारे ये बात है हमें आगे बढ़ाने की बीमारियों से ना तो छोड़कर अब स्वस्थ हमें है रहना श्री अन्न खाकर जियो हजारों साल बस यही है मेरा कहना बस यही है मेरा कहना वर्ड वी कुड चेंज द वर्ल्ड विल दिस अ वेरी वॉप आफ्टरनून टू रिस्पेक्टेड टू यू मेंबर्स टीचर्स एंड ऑल माय डियर फ्रेंड्स आई एम निशा चंदू ऑफ क्लास 10 फ्रॉम अटल कृष्ण गवर्नमेंट इंटर कॉलेज स्कूल द टॉपिक ऑफ टुडे साइंस सेमिनार इज अ सुपर फूड और अ डाइट का सो लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड इट व्हाट डू यू मीन बाय सुपर Millets are a superfood containing non-starch polysaccharides, gluten-free proteins, and a low glycemic index. But it is still be a diet fad because so many people consume it just for weight loss, without knowing the several health benefits they are getting from it. So millets are a superfood because they provide numerous health benefits to everyone. Now, what is the millet mission? This year, 2023 has been declared as the International Year of Millets by United Nations, following the Indian proposal. India, by the way, wants to position itself as the global hub for millets. Interestingly, millets can be a very important tool and contribute to our collective efforts, such as empower small holding farmers, achieve sustainable development, eliminate hunger, adapt to climate change. Millets have so many nutritional benefits. With carbs containing 21 grams, proteins with 6 grams, fats with 1.7 grams, along with phosphorus, magnesium, iron, zinc, etc. Millets are a profitable option for small holder farmers and realize the significance of millets. Interestingly, in our own state of Uttarakhand, its cabinet members have approved the millet scheme to promote its traditional grains such as malwa and sugar. They say, Madhuwa Chumbora Thayenge Udra Khand Banayenge. Who is this? Millets have so many health benefits. According to the article of 2018, the government has indicated millets as the powerhouse of nutrients, as they can make the great difference in the fight against diabetes. But if we talk about the ecological benefits, then an article at www.egoonline.com states that millets require 70% less water than thyme. They are the hardy crops that can withstand an extreme heat condition. They are economically cheaper than wheat and rice so that they can be used as a biofuel that is again a very interesting aspect. India is a vicious target articulated in 2018 is to exceed a 450 lakh tons of millets per year by 2030. Millets are terms to be known as the nutri cereals and they can be included to a healthy diet as well. Fingermen, that is also known as ragi, can prevent cardiovascular disorders. Permanent can be a very great option for brain functioning and immune system. Sorghum are very rich in antioxidants such as phenolic acids and tannins can lower the oxidative stress. Foxtail millets and crusoe millets that are again a very rich sources of fiber, protein along with vitamin B12 that can be very good for heart and nervous system. So overall, millets are very essential for the vitality of the human body. But despite having so many potential benefits, still millets are considered as a diet bar. Why? Because of the... Why? Because of the... Still, millets are considered as a diet bar because of the high oxalates present in them which can lead to kidney stone. And if I talk about the complex carbohydrates, so there is plenty of complex carbohydrates. It can lead to digestive issues. But don't worry, here's the solution. According to the ICMR, National Institute of Nutrition Hyderabad states that you can eat to 70 gram of cereals, including 90 to 100 gram of millets in that. So overall, despite having just some disadvantages, still millets are considered as a super food. Do you know why? Because of the enormous benefits. With this, I want to ask a question to my respected judges and my lovely audience as well. That, would you like to consume millets in your healthy diet? I think the answer is maybe no or maybe yes. Even if I talk about myself, in starting, I do not like the taste of these nutri cereals. But when I went through the benefits, I started taking them. Neither so much nor the less. After researching a lot about millets, 
My main concern was to satisfy that the people do really consume them or not. Then I start doing a survey at my own school with my teachers and the students as well. And you know what I got to know? That among 20 students, there were only two who eat sin. From the rest of all, some don't like the taste and some don't even know about what are milks. You can see the photos of a survey I have done in my school. This was very interesting as I got to know about so much information and I had a great feeling to be the child scientist at that time. With all this, I came to the conclusion that it's not only about you and me who have to consume minutes. It's about the whole world is consuming them. And do you know, minutes are also an integral part of the G20 meetings. The spirit of the whole government approaches to be seen in the celebration of the International Year of Minutes 2023, placing them as a super. Include these minutes in your daily diet, the